If you're feeling so fly like a G6, it's probably because you know the definitions of these 10 words that all start with the letter G. Let's do it. Hello, hello, and welcome to another episode of No Chit Chat Trivia, the trivia podcast with less talk and more trivia. Continuing our series on the letter G, I'm going to give you the definitions of 10 words that all start with the letter G, and you have to tell me those words. Let's jump right into it. Our first definition is usually unauthorized writing or drawing on a public surface. Usually unauthorized writing or drawing on a public surface. Definition number two, a climate controlled structure enclosed and usually used year round for the cultivation or protection of tender plants. A climate controlled structure enclosed and usually used year round for the cultivation or protection of tender plants. Number three, a person who is responsible for the care and maintenance of a particular area of land such as an estate, a park, or a cemetery. A person who is responsible for the care and maintenance of a particular area of land such as an estate, a park, or a cemetery. Definition number four, the study of the classes of words, their inflections, and their functions and relations in the sentence. The study of the classes of words, their inflections, and their functions and relations in the sentence. Number five, an often small mechanical or electronic device with a practical use, but often thought of as a novelty. An often small mechanical or electronic device with a practical use, but often thought of as a novelty. Definition number six, pleasantly kind, benevolent, and courteous. Pleasantly kind, benevolent, and courteous. Number seven, an agreement by which one person undertakes to secure another in the possession or enjoyment of something. An agreement by which one person undertakes to secure another in the possession or enjoyment of something. Definition eight, to shine faintly or unsteadily. To shine faintly or unsteadily. Number nine, to deceive a person or group of people through repetition of a constructed false narrative. To deceive a person or group of people through repetition of a constructed false narrative. And our final definition today, a source of satisfaction or pleasure. A source of satisfaction or pleasure. Those were our 10 definitions on words that start with the letter G. Let's stick around to see how many you knew. Welcome back, getting into our answers. Our first definition was usually unauthorized writing or drawing on a public surface. Those unauthorized markings are known as graffiti. Graffiti. Number two, a climate controlled structure enclosed and usually used year round for the cultivation or protection of tender plants. Those type of structures are known as a greenhouse. A greenhouse. 
Definition 3. A person who is responsible for the care and maintenance of a particular area of land, such as an estate, a park, or a cemetery. That person is known as a groundskeeper. A groundskeeper. Number 4. The study of classes of words, their inflections, and their functions and relations in the sentence. This tricky definition is for the word grammar. Grammar. Definition 5. An often small mechanical or electronic device with a practical use but often thought of as a novelty. That is the definition of a gadget. Gadget. Number six, pleasantly kind, benevolent, and courteous. If someone is acting that way, they are gracious, gracious. Definition seven, an agreement by which one person undertakes to secure another in the possession or enjoyment of something. That person is making a guarantee, guarantee. Number eight, to shine faintly or unsteadily. That is the definition of glimmer, glimmer. Definition number nine, to deceive a person or group of people through repetition of a constructed false narrative. This has been a popular word over the last few years. It is gaslight, gaslight. And our final definition was number 10, a source of satisfaction or pleasure. Often we're looking for this source in an instant. It is gratification, gratification. That's it for today. I hope you had a good time figuring out those words. We have one more episode on the letter G in a couple weeks. So be sure to hit that follow button so you never miss a single episode. And we'll see you next time. Bye.